Hi everyone. So today we're going to solve some math question. Okay. So suppose the revenue is in this function r x equals to negative one point x square plus two seven two x, and the cost is in this function. Okay, which is a very long function, and we are going to write it in a way where it's more readable. Okay. So let's just write again our x function is okay so we have negative 1.3 x square plus 272 x okay great now we have the cost is in function of x equals to 0 0.0 zero two x cube minus two x square plus sixty five x plus six hundred okay great now the first question here the a question asks for the profit function so let's just change our color to orange so the profit, the formula of the profit function is given as revenue minus cost, right? Which is makes sense, right? Okay, now we are going to write the revenue function, which is negative, okay, 1.3x squared plus 272x so this is the revenue function minus and now we are going to my uh, deduct our cost which is 0.02 x cube minus 2x square plus 65x plus 600 plus 600 and we are going to close our bracket okay now we just need to solve this first we are going to open the bracket so as you can see here you have a negative sign before the bracket okay so let's just open the bracket so for this one because we do not have any negative sign so it's just easy for us just to open the bracket just need to write what it is so negative 1.3 x square plus 272 x now because there is a negative you need to multiply to each of here okay so here you have okay so this negative need to be multiplied to each of this okay so okay so now you will have negative multiply with plus you are going to have a negative right so negative 0 0.02 x cube now you have negative multiply with negative 2 x squared so negative negative is going to give you a positive 2 x squared plus okay sorry so now negative multiply with negative multiply with positive that is going to give you a negative number so negative 65 x now similarly positive with negative is going to give you a negative sign which is 600 now what how do you remember positive and negative uh who are going to have what sign when they multiply so basically if you have same sign multiply same sign like if you have negative multiply with negative when you have same sign it's always going to give you a positive similarly positive multiply with positive that's going to give you a positive and when you have different sign okay different sign like let's say you have positive multiply with negative you will have a negative answer okay so here you can see 
negative multiply with positive it gave you a negative number negative multiply with negative positive negative positive negative negative positive negative very good now what we are going to do is we are going to group them in so what do you mean by group them in so you want to see you want to see the x here so here you have x squared so you want to check okay what are the other one that has x squared here so x squared is going to group with x squared so let's just uh okay so we are going to have negative 1.3 plus 2 so these are going to be x squared do we have any more x squared no we don't okay now let's see what's next so x here which else we have x so this so you want to plus 272 okay because there is negative 65 you cannot plus it you have to negative 65 close the bracket give it x okay now we want to do with the cube okay because we do not have any other cube so we can just write it as it is negative 0 0.02 x cube and the last one that we have is negative 600 so negative 600 now you can solve this one so it's going to give you negative 1.3 plus 2 it's going to give you 0 0.7 x squared plus okay now solve this one 272 minus 65 so that's going to give you 207 right so 2 So that's going to give you 207x. Okay, now just write whatever we are left with. Okay, so this is our profit function. Okay, I hope it makes sense. Okay, so we are going to do the B and C in another video. Thank you.